Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel Go Dynamic IT. Are you looking for a free official version of Windows 11 for your computer? In this video, I'll guide you how to download the latest official version of Windows 11. If you have a newer PC, you are all set to go ahead with Windows 11. However, if you have an older PC, check the minimum requirement on your screen. If your PC meets with this requirement, you can proceed with the download and installation. So let's see what is the requirement. It says that you need a processor with minimum one gigahertz. So this is the minimum hardware requirement you can see here. So it's required one gigahertz of the processor. If you have a two cores, well and good. You need a minimum four GB of RAM, 64 GB of your hard, disk, hard drive storage. And if your BIOS UEFI or secure boot capable, that's also good. It supports the TPM, Trusted Platform Module. You have a graphics card here. Or normally, all the PCs have a graphics card, either the external or the internal one. And the display is minimum 72p. So if you have an older monitor also, it's going to support. So, okay, so let's proceed with the installation. So this is about your system requirement. So we have to go to the Google and type uh, download Windows 11. So you can see this is the first link, download Windows 11. Click on this uh, link here and we go come back to the Microsoft official website. So guys, I don't go and download this ISO from third party website because they give the botware and then there are lots of malware and viruses and that. When Microsoft is already giving the official and the free download, it, why you want to go and download it from the third party software? Software, right so scroll it down and you can see here download the ISO file so you have to select which version you want so I want this Windows 11 multi edition this is a 64 bit click on the download so it's validating the download now it says that you have to select the language and the timing you have to select the language so in the language I would select English International and click on the confirm okay so it says that uh, this is the English International go ahead and download with the 64 bit and he says that this link is valid for 24 hour so if you want to share this link with somebody else you can also go ahead and do that click on the 64 bit download you can see this is downloading now so I would say how do you get the links let me click on this download and you see click on the full download history here and you can see this is showing you the full download history what we have to do is right click okay so either you can copy this link you can see this is the highlighted link copy this one copy link address or you can go to the any other tab and just paste it enter the second download is started or you can just copy and paste it to, to somebody else. He can go ahead and download it from the same link. But that has to be within a 24 hour. Okay, so you can see this download is downloading is started. And now if you want to verify your download. So sometimes what happens is like when you are downloading the file, whether it's uh, complete or not, or is something miss, missing or not, you can go ahead and, and do the hashing of this file. So you can see this is the command. You can go to the command PowerShell. You can see go to the PowerShell and run this command. And then once you go to the run the command, you have to match this hashing value. So you can see these are the different languages. So we have downloaded the English. So you can see English International. So when you run the command, this exactly this text has to match with this result, whatever the result comes in. So this is how you can verify it so that it, you have add this is about this adding a extra level of security on it right so this is downloading now okay once the download completed we will go with the installation with the oracle vm virtual box so we'll go ahead and install this as a virtual machine on the virtual box and we'll discuss it what is the virtual box also in the next thank you very much for watching my video see you in the next